Hello? Oh, there's the whole thing, and I forgot to hit all the buttons that actually fix the way it works. Uh, that's probably it. There you go, you should be hearing it now. There it is! <laughs> Enormous. Oh, there's the boy. Look at him. He's a guy! He's just a thousand doors! This is the best from soft game. Oh, don't don't touch the memory card. So I got a, I got a GameCube hooked up to a toaster, hooked up to a fishbowl, hooked up to the PC, hooked back up to the GameCube, hooked back up to the fishbowl, hooked back to the toaster, hooked back to the PC, and it's, uh, through that is how I'm recording. What's my his name is Mario? What do you mean? It's Mario. That's not even a thing. It's just the name of the save file, you know. So we're just gonna call it Mario. The Mario. Bada bing bada boom. Huge. It should have been Luigi? Oh no! Don't worry, you get to see uh you get to see Luigi right quick. Look at this dude! Look at this creature! He's just a funny little guy. <laughs> mail call? I do I do a mail call every morning. I just go, ah! And that's that's my mail call. There's Luigi. Luigi. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> hey, bro, check it out. The letter from Princess Peach arrived for you. That's what he says. He goes, hey, bro. This is Luigi. I'll just read it to you. How does that sound? All right. Uh, now let's see here. A uh, bada bing bada boom. Trapped in another castle. Can you come get me? Hello there, Mario. I am now on holiday, traveling in the Mushroom Kingdom. In my travels, I came into possession of a mystical map, a treasure map, actually. It was inside a box I got from an old merchant in a town called Rogueport. But since it would be too difficult for me to try to go find treasure all by myself, I thought you could help me hunt for it. You will, of course, won't you? I've included the map with this letter, so please bring it with you when you come. I'll meet you at Rogueport. That means you must come. Peach. Not the first time Peach has told Mario he must come. What do you know? It's true. There's a weathered old map in here with the letter. What a funny meme. Check it out. Hey, bro. Here you go. That's the map. <laughs> I mean, you could call it a map. It's more of like a general impression. Ooh, look. It's green now. Did everything break? Is it all gone and we're going to have to stop the stream and try to fix this? Oh, no. This is so sad. <laughs> Oh no, it's all gone. All right, I'll be right back. Oh, no, maybe? It's fine, it's fine, it was a bit. Of course it was a bit, yeah. This game is seamless. <laughs> it did break for a second there. But it's okay. I think it's fine now. It's just temperamental a little bit. Just a little temperamental. Yeah, let's see if I break it again. Yeah! It's the Legend of Zelda sound. Okay, don't break again. Now <laughs> oh, the breaks are funny. That's what we look for. Oh shit, it's the prologue! Oh, look at this three-faced, four-faced coin! <laughs> a rogue's welcome. It's like a warm welcome, but it's rogue's welcome. It's like a play on words. It's like an entendre. Just a single entendre, though. Not a double one. That's how I snore. Excuse me, sir. Please wake up, sir. The town you'd been speaking of has come into view. Look, that's Rogueport. Oh, you fucking for real, man? Fucking nuts. Look at this. This is a little town. It's Rogueport. Look at that water. It's beautiful. It's got circles in it. You see, we'll arrive shortly. Please prepare to disembark. What a funny meme. I'm so excited. Oh, look at that dude! He's, he's twirling! He's got an eye patch! He's a real rough and tumble guy. How are they gonna park the boat? They're gonna have to, like, flip it around the other way? I must apologize, sir. Our arrival was delayed just a bit by rough weather. Are you quite sure you want to disembark here? 
I did tell you all the stinky do dirty boys and dirty stinky tales about Rogueport on our way here, did I not? What's that? I'm sorry, you say there's a princess waiting here for you. Is that so? Uh, of course, sir. I'm sure you're not high on meth amphetamine like everyone else in this town, and you're very reasonable. Well, if that's what you think, then I won't stop you. But, uh, you be careful, sir. Don't say I didn't warn you. You know, keep your wallet in the front pocket is what he's saying. Oh! Oh, fuck. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Oh, I'm, I'm down to 9 health already! It's all gone! Oh, if this was uh, Spy Kids 3 the game, that would have been quite significant. Oh, let's fucking... Oi! Welcome to Rogueport! Bit of a nasty place, eh? You got guts coming here. You look a bit green, so have a wee bit of advice on me. Hit that save block to save! Because the thing about life is you never know when you're gonna kick the old bucket. I like how hitting A is the like the button to like save and do all the menu interaction, and then if I keep mashing A, I'll jump and thus trigger the menu again. So I think that's pretty good design. I got a hammer. I got a slight downward tilt on my controls. I like that. Junior Cortez? Yeah, it's exactly that. <laughs> hey, what do you want? Get away from me, freak! Oh my god, is that some woman getting harassed by a bunch of weirdos? Oh, come off it, you airhead. I know it's tough for you, but don't play dumb with me. I've seen you wanking around town asking for information about the Crystal Stars. I'm sure that's what you said. Well, now I'm done asking, so be a good girl and tell us what you know right now. Never. I don't have anything. I don't even got arms. Get away from me, you creeps. Ew. I suppose it wouldn't be right if a sassy little lass like you met with an untimely demise. <laughs> Boys! We're fucking doing a kidnapping. We're doing a, sh a snatch. We're doing a traffic. Quick, get them. As you command, Lord Crump, we're on it. Alright, this seems pretty good. No, stop right there, you weirdos. I'll scream, really. Fuck, Mario's gonna just watch how this plays out. Go on. Oop. That's what the... Get her. Go on. What do you make of this green guy? Yikes, looks like trouble over there. Probably best not to get involved, huh? I wouldn't meddle with other people's problems in this town, even if I had an extra life. Well, you heard the green guy. I don't think we can really do anything about this. I think the green guy is right. We've got to just settle... Oh, shit. I think she spotted me. I could go anywhere with smelly lunatics like you. <laughs> not likely. <laughs> what do you think you're doing, chump? You think you can screw up my plans? Who, me? I don't even fucking know this person. Yeah, it's always something. Looks like I'm gonna have to give you a little taste of the old... ...anabolic steroids. Oh shit. Can't flee this fight, and I got 9 health already. Battle time, Mr. Man. Just find a way to beat the shit out of him. Don't sweat the details. Just jump on him and hit him with your hammer. Don't need to tell me twice. I'll jump on him right now. Press A just before stomping on an enemy. There you go. That's like two stumps. Why does the bomb have a do-rag? Because it's, uh, it's, you know, it's trying to get waves. That's what they're for, right? Sweet, you know that hurt. Wow, I gotta say, you're tougher than you look. Keep it up and you'll beat them in no time. Aw, oh, fucking blocked you, you idiot. That's called a, that's almost a parry. You can actually parry in this game, it's insane. Uh, let's, let's do the hammer now. Let's fucking wang them real good. Ooh, ooh. Oh, the fucking background hit me for one damage. What is this? <laughs> You've got him on the ropes. Come on. Oh, I, I, I fucked the timing. <laughs> Alright, let's do the... Let's, let's do the one jump. Oh, that's a stylish. He's dead. You did it. You did it. Yes. And you got star points. Hell yeah. Yeah, and I bet you, you know, but you get these things called star points when you win battles. When you get a hundred million star points, you'll go up a level. Don't forget that, okay? We're already at nine! We're like a tenth of the way there, or even nine percent. I got a couple of decent shots in, I'll give you that. But, unfortunately for you, that means 
if the purple one don't win, then they all jump in, is what I think he said. Fucking go nuts on him! I think Mario's dead. Quick, this way! What do you mean, this way? Uh, I guess we'll just leave. What a bunch of idiots! <laughs> Let's sneak out of here, what do you say? Bye-bye. <laughs> but? Stop! <laughs> what is he saying? What does the bomb do, right? Where'd they go, huh? Dude, Johnson, did you see them? Did anyone? Did anyone see my Johnson? Oh, crud. They bolted. No, he can't say that! The bot didn't like it, but I'm gonna allow it. <laughs> it's a gamer term, you know? It's in reference to their funny double-pointed hats. Wow, mister, you totally saved me. Thanks. <laughs> they got this whole lynching post right here all set up, just in case. <laughs> I just got to give you a little reward. What do you mean? <laughs> Fucking stuff off, bitch, I'm spoken for. My name's Goombella, and I'm a student at the University of Goom. Wink. That's not a real place. I think I think she's making this up. I don't think there is such a thing as Goom. I think it's <laughs> it's the game. It is the game. Is the newest title from FromSoft. Nice to meet you. Ah, so who are you? Oh, my name's Mario. <laughs> Wait, you mean like that famous funny guy who does the jump move? Yeah, that's the one. Cool. Anyway, no offense, but it looks like you just rolled into town yourself. What? But it looks like you just rolled into town yourself, right? Yeah, that's how you, that's how she said it. I mean, already, I already hate it here. There are freaks and weirdos and b gaboons everywhere. It's nasty, disgusting place. I mean, I know the place is called Rogueport, so I should have expected it. But sheesh, there's a furry in the background right now with a lemon on his head. Like, what what is it to be expected? I'd never come to a place like this if there weren't some legendary treasure here. What the fuck's happening in the background? Who are these? Viva Pinata characters. Oh, you're looking for a legendary treasure too? Seriously? Whoa, 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 Bucko! What you got there? Is that is you just excited to see me, or is that a map in your pocket? Ah, it was a map. Oh my gosh, isn't that a treasure map? You have to tell me where you got that. What are the Viva Pinata characters doing in the background? Princess Peach, what? Great, Hoogly Boogly. If it isn't Master Mario, I hope that wasn't a slur. What's happening over there? Are they getting hate crime? <laughs> oh no, bro! <laughs> the boss sends his greetings. I was dead rooted. Oh my god. There's just an assault happened behind us. <laughs> Bit of coincidence bumping into one uh, another in this sort of place. Hmm, ho ho ho. So tell me, Master Mario, what in the world brings you to this wretched little burg? Wretched little burg. Hmm, ah, indeed. Princess Peach sent you a letter and a treasure map. Yeah, absolutely. And she told you she'd meet you here in Rogueport. Intriguing. You're asking me where Princess Peach is? Ah, oh, fucking couldn't tell you. I was about to ask you that. We stopped in this town to acquire a spot of fuel for our ship, don't you know? I only took my eye off her for but a moment. But as soon as she... I did, she was gone. Like a dog in the dark. Oh, headstrong she is, Mario. I just assumed she'd be back momentarily. By this point, I fear we must uh, embrace the possibility that she may never return. She might be dead. I've been at a loss to what to do. I've been fraught with worry, I tell you, but not too much. But I'm feeling better with you here, Master Mario. Surely we'll find her. Surely. I know my place, Master Mario, and this is not it. I leave this task to you. Goodbye. I wanna go have a go in the inn right over there and enjoy a spot of tea, perhaps. In fact, I highly recommend it, particularly if you find your HP or healing potassium running low. Just drop on in. <laughs> yes, anyway, a little rest will, uh, there, will fill all your HP up. I might slow though, the rest of this town is a bit rough. Yes, rough indeed. Huff, huff, I say. Huff, I say. Uh, Princess P. 
peach? Did he mean like Peach the Mushroom Kingdom Princess? That's like a po political figure of grand magnitude in the world scene. The princess who always gets nabbed by Bowser, the Koopa King, the one you rescued? Wait a sec, this is crazy. Princess would sent you that treasure map? Yeah, of course. Who else would? This is really intense. Well, there we could, uh, could she have gone then, do you think? You think maybe she got sick of waiting and went to find the treasure on her own? Mayhaps? Ooh, ooh, I know Mario. Come with me. One of my professors is here researching that treasure map. We'll show him your map. If we start looking for the treasure, then maybe we'll catch up to Princess Peach. Great! We're all good then. Let's go, Mario. Oh shit! Goombella joined the party! Oh fuck. It's a whole bit. Hello. Goombella's abilities. A. Primer. Press X. I hardly know. <laughs> Press X to get information about nearby people, places, and objects. Aw, oh, so you should just fucking talk shit about people. It's the center of town and the main business district. It's a crossroads where many people meet, including more than a few shady characters. She's the Dark Souls item description getter. <laughs> Anytime you press X when there's no one around, I'll tell you about where we are. Who the fuck is this guy? That's Goomster. Goomba. He's always complaining about being swindled or mugged. <laughs> If you press X when there's somebody nearby, I'll tell you about him or I'll talk mad shit. So did you get all that? Yeah, I think I, I think I got it all. And then answers, ask for information often. And of course, Gabella can be quite helpful in battle too. She jumps in the air to attack enemies with a nasty head bomb. She can also look up enemy HP and weaknesses with her tattle ability. I'm thinking her tattle ability adds them to the Pokedex, which is actually enormous. First off, we gotta go find the, my professor. Thing is, since I just got to town myself, um, I don't know where he lives. So keep an eye out. He looks like this. You see my thought bubble? It's like that. Oh shit, we got like a little ten pound thing. Oh, let's see if we can like line this up. Take a screenshot. <laughs> uh, what's back here? What's in this spooky alley? Good, my guy. Umbella, what's the Pokedex say? That's a suspicious Dugan. He craves that one big score, but I doubt it'll happen. I mean, even if he did make some money, he'd just blow it. He depresses me. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Way to comment on the memes. Is this Goomther? That's Magoomba. A Goomba, obviously. I think maybe he's on the lamb from somewhere. I mean, Rouse would be chilling back in this alley. It's nasty here. That's pretty nuts. Bada bing bada boom. Excuse me. What's in here? Oh my god, it's a star piece! Who would've guessed? No sprint button or nothing. We're just gonna be going. Yeah, let's save. Why not? Saving's good. Oh my god, a star piece! Who would have guessed? <laughs> Fuck off! Oh, what's your beef, pal? Yeah, I'm talking to you. Who was that? Bella, do your do your po Pokedex. You gotta wake. You gotta wake up. That guy just stole half of your coins. You were keeping it in your front pocket, didn't you? Pickpockets in this this sort of town, they specialize in picking pocket only from the front pocket. So we can go beat the shit out of that guy. Oh dickhead. Oh fancy meeting you here, pretty damn persistent buddy. What a pain. Fine, fine, okay, you got me, I'll give you your coins back here. Let me give you a news flash. Even the innocent looking people in town are thieves. So don't come grumbling to me about losing a little pocket change, okay, buddy? I stole a fucking a $50 bill off of me. And he's saying, like, oh, this pocket change was kind of made of money or something? What is this? What a silly guy. Environmental factor, surely. A pickpocket knows the side path of the Stormvale, though. He does know the, the side path into Stormvale. And he can like release. Oh no, shit, it's him again. No, it's not. Don't be racist. <laughs> he can open the main gate for you. Oh fuck, a Starfies. Who would have guessed? <laughs> oh, that's absolutely nutty. 
All right. Ding dong. Hand over. All right, you see that thing in the top right? That's going to be for the future, so write that down. Oh, hi there. You are Professor Frankly. I frankly can't believe it took us this long to find you. Who's the... Who's there? Who wants me? God, that you finally come to take your unholy revenge on me? Doom man? Ah, yes, you. Now, you, um, seen your face before in a dream. Yes, that face. Wait for it. Just a moment. Don't tell me now. I'll get it right. You are... It's not Goombriel. Uh, it's not Liza Goom. Those are all my biblical Goomba names. Hmm. Uh. Ah, I've got it! You're Goombella, aren't you? You were in my archaeology class last year, am I right? Ah, yes, sir, that's me. I'm Goombella. A junior, right? You, Goom. Go Goombas! That feels weird. That's like having humans as your mascot. Of course I remember you. Not too many... Not, not to toot my own horn. But I feel like you were doing enough tooting of my horn for the both of us. But I'm pretty good at remembering. You, though, you stick out in my mind because you were such an exceptional student. He's winking at the camera. And that guy behind you is... Who? Who's first Mario? Mario Professor. He's Mario, you know, the famous one. The one from those uh, video games. Oh, my apologies. I'm such a bookworm. I haven't a clue what's hip right now. In any case, what sort of errand brings you to all the way to a place like this? See, he knows him as Jumpman, that's why. <laughs> Greendale human being is the best mascot. It is the best mascot. You're absolutely right. Maybe the Goomba isn't so bad. We were hoping you'd tell us about the legendary treasure said to be below Rogueport. I thought that if anyone knew anything about it, you would, Professor Frankly. And frankly, I'm in disbelief that you don't know anything about it. Of course, I know about it. It was the reason I came here was to study that very subject. Why else would I be sitting in this stinky old rogue port? But why do you tykes want to learn about the legendary treasure? You know that most say it's a little more than a fairy tale, don't you? Archaeologists and historians have to search for the truth in those fairy tales, though. Me, I believe legendary treasure truly does exist, and I really want to find it. Good point, and we'll make the case, and I'll cooperate with you however I can. First of all, about the treasure, there are many mysterious surrounding it. Some say Cosm, and some say Cosm. It's an infinitely vast treasure hoard, while others say it's a magical item. Some books say it's actually a monster, while still others claim it's an empty chest. So many different theories, obviously it's impossible to divine the truth among them. But among the three tales of the Alpha Legion, each one has a hint of truth. But all agree on one point, to find the treasure one must have the crystal stars. To find the treasure of yore, take the seven crystal stars to the thousand year door. It rhymes, so it's gotta be true. You mean the crystal stars in that old saying that super elderly people pass down? Like you? Indeed, the same as the saying goes, but we just say it's normal people that pass it down. You first must collect the seven crystal stars. Hold on, the magical mactal off of the entrance of the thousand door. Then the stars will light the way and lays the stones of yesterday. A lot of lore I've read says that if this magical map is taken to the doorway, then it'll show you where to find the funny crystal stars. Correct, and the thousand year door is supposedly here deep beneath this town. Yet the critical piece of the puzzle, the magical map, is lost. If only we had that map. But we do have it, dumbass! Well, not we exactly. Mario has the magical map. That's what the M in Mario stands for. What? Hamani bahubrabda, hibidi hubida, hamala hafala hufala. Really? You, you actually have it. Could I just take a quick look at it, if you don't mind? Astounding. This is it. The real thing. The one and only magical map. You, son, are my hero. You're great, fantastic, wonderful even. I could suck you off right now. With this, we can find the crystal stars just by holding this all off before the legendary door. Right on, Professor. Good golly, what are we doing just sitting here then? Gumbella Mario, off we must assist and to go do the funny door bit. Oh, I thought I was following you. Okay, I guess. Hey, you just go over here. I bet you didn't know this wrong thing. It just comes off. It just falls off of the existence. And we can use this pipe to go down under the sea streets. Come on, both of you. Let's get moving. Okay. Oh, wait. Hang on a second, Mario. Something just occurred to me. What's that? I'm fairly certain there are quite a few hoodlums below. So, uh... Fucking... Wallet in the front pocket. You two do know about your action commands, don't you? Um... I don't know what that means. No! 
positively shocking. In that case, you gotta take a second to learn. We'll have a little practice session. Gumbella, you could be Mario's opponent. Oh, I gotta beat the shit out of Gumbella? Alright. Oh, gee, I'm okay. I'll do my best, sir. I have not condoned violence against... Goombas. First, we'll practice the jump action command. That's- oh, okay, it just means, like, how do you do it gooder than before. Yeah, 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 and then you jump on their heads. No, I already hit it. I hit it as- as you paused. And you can do, like, a stylish if you hit it again. And you can block them when they're, like, about to hit you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, this makes sense. Yeah, yeah, I, I remember. I remember. And this one? I used to do this one all the time as a kid because it was the easiest. <laughs> but the jump is so much better because when you get plus one damage, it gives plus one to the hammer, making it three, but it gives plus one to each of the jump, making it four, which is fucking huge. Uh, try to kill him. Oh, this is really hard. You gotta hit like B. And then like you do you do a parry, and then the repose deals one damage to them. If you do a super guard with B, you take no damage and you damage bad, bad. But the super guards are harder to do than the standard guard. Choose wisely between them. Yeah, I'm only gonna ever fucking do the, the green ones. The, the red ones are like impossible. Yeah, I got it. Uh, nah, I got it. That's, that's good. Easy, easy, easy as nothing. Well, uh, yeah, let's fucking get in there, man. Before we do, I'm gonna just have a little sip. Okay. And... Oh. I, I hit the A button to, to jump, but it was the A button to talk instead. Oh shit, let's save. Hell yeah. It's over here. Oh shit, it's over there. Oh my god, a star piece! <laughs> Oh, uh, one day we'll get through there. We gotta talk to that- that person's like super important. It's like insanely important how, how good that person is. This person I don't- it does not matter. But yeah, that person. That person's gonna be super important. That little- that little blue feature. Okay, off we go. There are all these fucking Dark Souls return to the beginning of the game shortcuts that you will unlock. Hey man! What's up? Who's the hottie you got there with you? I'm here to do an assault. What's up, baby? Why don't you hang with us for a while? We play real nice. Look at this fucking man. That's how he talks. That's fucking crazy. Do you hear that? That's the game. Oh, it, it, it is like so. so but saying seriously, uh, could you make me the barf now? Get out of the way. Oh, that was so cool. Uh, what, you're too good for us? Come on for those- It's fucking nuts, man. You hear that? The game's crazy. Alright, Professor, kill him. The only one I should- yeah, yeah, don't jump on the fucking spike, and he can't hit him with the hammer because he's in the air. Oh, you can have Goombella attack first as a treat. Uh, yeah, I do want that because I want her to add them to the Pokedex. That's a Goomba. Oh uh, yeah, I'm, I'm one of those. In case you hadn't noticed, uh, it says here Goombas are stinky, dirty, ugly boys. The fire. No, the soundtrack's so fucking good. What are you talking about? That is totally rude. Their maximum HP is two. They have an attack power of one. A defense of nothing. All right. Well, that sounds like a hammer. <laughs> oh shit! He took drugs. Oh shit! He gave drugs to that guy. Huge attack power is now boosted. Oh my god! We did so much more damage. All right. Let's title on that one. That's a Paragoomba, basically a Goomba with wings. I'm jealous. Maximum HP is 2, attack is 1, and defense is 0. You can't hammer it while it's in flying, well, it's flying, but rough it up and it'll totally plummet. Wink. He's 
he's dead. Fucking gotcha, idiot! <laughs> That's a spiky Goomba! A spiky-headed Goomba, what a creative name. That spike is super pointy, so it's better to hit it with a hammer than jump on it. Maximum HP 2, attack is 2, and defense is 0. The addition of the spike means you'll hurt your feet if you jump on it. Yeah, that seems pretty straightforward. Oh, I tried to do the backflip, but it didn't work. <laughs> we got 10 whole XB! Star points! And we got to, like, add all these to our Pokedex. No, you're dead! Get back here and be dead. There, losers. Ah, ready, Mario? There are plenty more dirty, stinky boys where they came from. When they attack, try to hammer them or jump on them while in the field. Attack successfully, and you can perform a first strike when you enter battle. Remember, uh, Sun Shu, Art of War, tip number one. Kill the man before he kills you. I don't think it's anything this way. I think you gotta, you gotta do a little jump thing. What is this bit? Oh, I'm sure it's something pretty damn neat. Oh fuck, <laughs> my lightly listing controller that goes down, uh, went down. There we go. Oh. Gotcha. What a fool. Oh, he's just like gonna instant die. Double stylish! What a guy. No oh, shit. Well. See, you, you can't normally hit him with the hammer, but if you're a tricky little, little guy. A quarter of the way to leveling to level two. Flower power there, rolling in it. Mushroom. You got an item. You can use items to attack enemies and replenish your heart points. Press the start button and choose items from your screen thing. That's fine. He's dead. Oh, it's gonna be over there. Oh shit! Fire flower! I didn't know those broke immediately. What's this way though? Uh, I can't do nothing with that. No, nothing. So I guess we're going this way. Huge. Oh my god, it's a star piece! There you go. What the fuck is this creature? What, did you see that abomination? What the fuck is that thing? There you go. <laughs> this little guy. Oh, it's only one. He's lived! Alright, you're gonna have to Pokedex this one. That's a Spinia, a totally weird creature made up of thin, papery boards. It certainly looks unique, nobody knows much about these creatures, actually. Max HP is 3, attack is 1, and defense is 0. It attacks are super swift, but it should be pretty easy. Just give it a hee Alright, let's give it a hee yeah. yeah. Did you hear him? He literally said that. We got 5 flower power, but nothing to spend it on. There we go. It's gotta keep wanging it. Oh shit, there's two of them. That's like six health total. If only my stylish, you know, actually contributed to something. I don't know when to hit the button for her stylish on that move. Jeez, what a fast boy. Oh, I fucked the Silas there. 
But, fucking loads of XP, look at that, we're up to 37 already. That's like, almost, uh, 37% of the way there. Oh, it's a thing! <laughs> Fuck yeah, stairs. <laughs> Love stairs. Oh, oh, I got black key! Oh, what could it open? That's fucking crazy. Oh, I bet it's not kind of like a dragon uh, rock kind of item, you know? What's in here? Oh, fucking funny chest. Whoa! Hey, you, can you hear me? You can? That must mean you're the hero of legend, obviously. Only the great hero of legend can hear my voice. Yeah, everyone else? Nothing. See, long ago in an ancient land, an evil spirit cast a curse on me, locking me in this box. I was bummed. I've been here ever since, waiting a long, long time for the hero to come by. So, yeah, anyway, big guy, what brings a hero like you to a place like this? Hey, Mario? Uh, I'll work with you. I'm not exactly confident that we can trust this funny box. Why, just because it has spikes and it's a little dark, that's it? I think it may be best not to mention that we're looking for the crystal stars. Well, drat. I just said it out loud! What's wrong with me? I'm a buffoon! Ah, oh, yeah, searching for the crystal stars, are you now? So, you really are a hero. Well, you're definitely gonna need my help if you hope to get those bad boys. So, first, you should look for the key to this box, then use it to let me out. Definitely. By the way, the key looks like this. Oh. Well, what do you think we ought to do, Mario? Mm -hmm. Well, I know my vote goes to you finding that key. I'm sure it's around here somewhere. <laughs> that looks like a key. That does look like a key. <laughs> Come on. Being stuck in a box is no picnic. I'm counting on you, oh great legendary hero. That's just my controller listing lazily downward. But I got the key right here. Whoa, 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 you brought the key. Yes, old man, I owe you big. Here you go. Yes! Think, ha, think nothing. Weehee! Fools! No, no, I think we got duped. <laughs> I think you got absolutely tricked. Oh boy, did you fall for it? I burned you. What, you think I was gonna help you? Instead, I'm gonna spread a little of the suffering I've endured in that stupid box. Yeah, sorry, but those are the breaks. I'm gonna cast an evil, terrible, horrible, disgusting, filthy curse upon you. Boogly woogly woo! You're cursed. Fuck you, Mario! Enjoy that curse, sucker! You got what you deserved! You wanna hear all about the sweet curse I just dropped? Then listen well. From now on, when you press Y in certain areas, you'll turn into a paper airplane. Wee hee hee! Trembling yet? Your days are fucking numbered, mate. Wee hee! Ooh, I can't help but the chortle! You're doomed! The curse is pretty rough, so I, I, I owe you an explanation, I guess. Ready to stand on an airplane panel like this one? And the flowers start to glow. And when you're on the panel, now press Y, and you turn to a paper airplane. The worst part of this course is you must tilt left or right on the controller to control yourself. Guess if you got good at it, you might fly a long way. That's only the good thing. So, best be honest, uh, yes, I get it, it's terrible. <laughs> Whee! If you press B, you might return to normal, maybe. Farewell, you foolish fool. Whee -hee -hee -hee. All right, time to go use this funny meme. What a fucking weirdo, guys. So, uh... What's that guy's beef? See, he's a minotaur, and he wants to make food, so he's got beef. Ooh. Yeah! We made it! No shit, son. Mario, Bella, look at that! It's a fucking door! It's a million years old, spoken of in the legends. I can't believe it's real, so the legends are all true. There it is. Big as light. God, let's, let's go touch it. Excuse me. Hey, what's the deal? This weird pedestal, huh? What could it be, you think? I'm sure if I stand on it, nothing bad will happen. 
I know I Mario'd it all up. Professor, what's going on? Well, it looks like I'm gonna fucking use this map to go find the star things like we just talked about earlier. Go Goombas! Oh my god, what is the map doing? Is it gonna break the game? I hope not. Oh, I hope I didn't jinx it by saying Oh shit! Oh, it's, it's like pointing out! That's where we gotta go! That's where the first star meme is! It's right there! It's the gray one! That's the least impressive color, that's why it's the first one. Bada beam! Look at that! The location of a crystal star has been recorded on your magical map. And Mario has learned a special move you can now use. Sweet treat. Each time you get a crystal star, you'll learn a new special move. I'm gonna fucking do some special moves then, yeah? Professor, the map! And what was with all those crazy funky lights? <laughs> it appears that information related to the locations of the crystal stars appeared. And that shining light, it looks as if a mysterious power was given to Mario. Well, one way or another, we should return to my place and study the map closely. Oh, yeah. If Mario thinks so, it's uh, probably a good idea. I don't trust this Goomba guy. I don't know, I'm not one for trusting Goombas, generally. That's, that's just Mario's backstory, he's got a lot to hate for Goombas. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh, I see! You understand it, Professor? My dear, of course I do. Firstly, about that light we saw shining on Mario. By my reckoning, Mario can outperform what is known as a special move. A special move? Yes, it, well, uh, stuff like this is better explained by example rather than words. Would you like to try it out? Yeah, sure, let's try out the special move. Excellent, in that case, we'll go outside since this place is a little cramped. Sun, moon, creature, the other one. First, take a close look at your star power gauge. My what now? Oh yeah, it has, it's one of one. One out of one. You'll see that your gauge has one power dot. Obviously, that's a single unit of power. So you're sitting on a single dot of star power with me so far. When you have star power available, you can use a special move. Try using Sweet Treat now. It's a special move that will replenish your HP and FP. Both stats found in popular From Software games, Dark Souls 3. Sweet Treat! Ah, oh, both of them, yeah. Repeatedly tilt left to shoot hearts and flowers. Oh, like flinging them. Really hard. <laughs> oh my god, I like burped when I left. It was terrible. I died. <laughs> Since you used one power dot, the star power gauge is now empty. Take a look. Yeah, it's fucking empty. I like replenished everything though. Killed seven, got my flower power back. Even if the gauge empties out though, you can still charge it up again. That's why the audience is watching your battles. That's you guys. You guys are the audience. You're watching the battle. It's so very important. You're like the most important part, see? Eleven. If you can get the audience excited, you'll build up more star power. Let me show you what I mean, Mario and Gubella. Try to attack me, please. Absolutely, yes. So they fill it up a little. Nice, see that? You thrilled your audience, so they filled up some of your gauge. Huge, that's like one tenth of it or something. Uh, let me do the hammer move, because I'm good at the spinner rule. And that should fill it up lots. I was like, it was more. <laughs> nice, keep building up that star power. Also, the more exciting your battles are, the more people will come to watch your fight. As you can see, that's reflected in the number of members in the audience. Or being just like that. Mario, this is your chance to hit it big. What do you mean? What is that? Nail an action command when you have two matching icons 
and icon wheels will appear. Give it a try. Oh shit, it's all gone. I got a bingo. That's a bingo. Oh my god, there's like 50 dudes. That's nuts. Fantastic, you matched three icons. When you match those icons, the crowd goes fucking nuts and people swarm the theater. 50,000 people used to live here. Plus, depending on the icons you match, up to your HP, flower power, or star power will flow up. But if you get three poison mushrooms, you fucked. Don't do that one. Still with me? The more people in your audience, the more star power you can get. You can also use the appeal command to get star power. I hope you memorized all this. Great Goomba's ghost Mario, look at your audience. He's he's fucking he's got a strap! He's strapped! Does that guy have a hammer? He does the bum! He means to toss it at you! Oh no! If the audience members hit you with anything, you'll take damage, obviously. You have to press X to stop them before they hit you. Oh my god, Mario jumps into the crowd and beats the shit out of an audience member. Aw, oh, what a what a powerful move. That's right, sweet justice. <laughs> you can press X to protect yourself from the objects the audience throws at you. Of course, fans of yours might toss good stuff like coins. Don't attack them. <laughs> well, that's all I've got. Here ends my scintillating lecture on special moves. Let's go back inside. Let's have a look at that magical map and see what we can learn about the- Whoa, Astounding! This map has a radar-like function. It now shows the location of a crystal star. Ah, and Metal Gear. It looks like the first crystal star is to be found in a place called Petal Meadows. Petal Meadows? They fucking stutter. Yes, the area is a vast meadow that lies far to the east of Rogueport. To tell you the truth, I've always thought that place was a tad suspicious. The name Petal Meadows did come up from the time to time in my meat research. Okay, fine, so we'll go there. Does anybody know how to get there or, or what? I'm fairly certain that somewhere beneath the city is a pipe to Petal Meadows. If you could just find that, you'd get there instantly. Pipe travels efficient. Say, by the way, Mario, I'm curious, where did you get that map anyway? See, a woman gave it to me. From Princess Peach, really? Her Highness sent this to you, Mario. The princess... Uh, she looked like this. That shit's like, that shit's a key. <laughs> so it is her! Your princess came to see me the other day. She wanted to learn about... the treasure. I told her about the Crystal Stars and my suspicion about Petal Meadows. It doesn't seem likely, but perhaps she tried to go to Petal Meadows on her own. You know, Professor, there was another suspicious group asking about the same thing. Hmm, but I can't imagine Princess Peach getting involved with them. Alright, it's settled. Off to Petal Meadows you two go. If Princess Peach indeed went there, your first priority must be to catch up to her. Collect the Crystal Stars is a means to an end, and that end is Princess Peach. Here, have a map. Aren't you coming, Professor? No, I'll stay in town and ask around about Princess Peach and that suspicious gang! Besides, I doubt a shriveled old Goomba like me could handle the trials of the road. Of course, if anything happens and you need some advice, come see me, okay? You got it, Professor. Well, Mario, we're off. We have a hundred bucks, and I think I saw a sh Wait just a moment! Power Smash! Mario, it's scary out there. Take this with you. It's a call. It's called a badge, and it is incredibly helpful. You see, depending on the badges you have equipped, you'll get much more powerful. What's important is knowing what the effects will be when you first equip a badge. Would you like to practice equipping and removing badges? Yeah, sure. In that case, first press start to access your menu. Boop. Uh, badges. Here. Press A to access the badges. Press A again to go into the badges. Press A again to equip the badge. You've equipped the badge. Press A to remove the badge. When you remove the badge, you regain the BP, the badge points. By the way, you need flower power to use the power smash move. In battle, you should watch not only your HP, but your FP too. Did you get all that? Well, here's hoping you find the pipe. Fuck off. Alright, let's put that badge on. Got power smash. But uh, what I was saying is, we have 100 coins. There's a shop to the left. Let's fucking go, let's go shopping. No, we're gonna save after the shop. <laughs> uh, I think there's a, like, gooder shop upstairs. 
Like, this is like a normal shop. We want to go up. We don't care for that. We care for, right? It's this one here. Fuck off, Toad Man. Yeah, there we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Uh, simple make action. Oh shit! What a meme. Make action commands easy, but l earn less star power. Meh. Uh, super appeal. Get more star power when Mario appeals. Ooh. Unsimple. Make action commands hard, but earn more star power. Ooh. Last step. Drop the damage your ally takes by half when in danger. That could be okay. Piercing blow. Deliver damage that pierces enemy defenses. That could be handy. Who the fuck are you guys? Welcome, welcome. Feel free to look around. Ah, welcome. House of Mouse. So, <laughs> what can I do for you? I'm buying. What kind of badges? Oh, let me see your special deals. If you're looking for special deals, you'll find them on that shelf. Otherwise, stand in front of the badge you want and press A. Wait. Oh, I'm selling. Oh, I don't want to sell Power Smash. All right, let's let's buy my Piercing Blow. Let's get let's get one of these. Let's get a Piercing Blow. Let's get a let's get a Last Stand P. Yeah. Let me get one of those. That's that's all my money. But oh my god, can you can you guys possibly fathom a star piece? <laughs> that's insane. Absolutely nutty. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go lay down some pipe. Get in a pipe. Travel via pipe. That's the one. Oh wait, we gotta do the badge point thing. Oh, we can just fucking equip all of them. Yeah, get them all on there. <laughs> uh, what a meme. Let's get badging. There we go. Whoop. Wahoo! Yeah, let's definitely this way. Is that a Goomba in my sewer? Oh fuck, I jumped on him. <laughs> Oops. Ouchie. <laughs> oh no. Normal hammer. Double stylish. Uh, you can't do jack in this fight, can you? Tactics. Defend. <laughs> Enormous. A million star points. I think we have nine whole health. Rolling in it. Ah, oh, and a coin. That's good for badge points. In there. What do you think this thing's about? Bloop! Bloop! I'm just gonna read the what it actually is saying. I'm, you guys can read the parentheses. Oh my god, it's an octopus. Bloop 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 uh, hey Mario, remember what Professor Frankly told us, right? You press Y to change your attack order. If your HP drops, you can press Y to put me in front. <laughs> when my HP drops, yeah, fucking right. You're going in front right now. <laughs> That's a blooper. A really big one. It's all slimy. I just totally can't stand slimy, nasty, icky things. Ugh. Max HP is 12, attack is 1, and defense is 0. It attacks with tentacles and ink. Once you damage both its tentacles, it'll fall down, and then it's time to attack. By the way, the tentacles each have 3 HP. Now relax, and house on that slimy, nasty blooper. What? What does house mean? Let's use a fire flower. We haven't used one of these yet. That's what it does! He's so sad! Oh, we can power smash them. Yeah. 
fucking insane! Look at that! A billion! He's <laughs> going nuts. He's going ham in the dollar store. Uh, jump. Twenty XP. Huge. Giant blooper stats. Bloop bloop bloop. It's fucked. It's gone. He's dead. <laughs> Fuck you, <Bella. laughs> Why'd you fall? Oh my god, are we getting out of the prologue? Are we going into chapter one? Oh my god, that's insane! Chapter one! We've gotten so far. I feel like we've progressed so many. Castle and dragon. It's like that one thing, like the dungeon and the other one. It's basically Baldur's Gate 3. Look at that, there's a castle. Petal Meadows. This place is nuts! It's like green! It's so much nicer than that other shithole. Well, here we are in the Petal Meadows, where folks say a crystal star hides. Woohoo! Here we go, Mario! The start of our adventure! This is pretty wacky. Oh my god, it's a mushroom. Oh my god, it's a star piece. Wow! Oh shit. Just like in Dark Souls, there's a dragon. Or Dungeon Dragons when there's a dragon. Whoa, what what was that? Ooh, is that a wow, Mario, look. The fucking dragon. The straight up dragon. What do you think the dragon? Totally incredible. I've never seen anything that humongous before. It looked kind of scary too. Weird. Professor Frankly said that this place was peaceful, and frankly, I called him a liar. Uh, we just started, and there's a funny dragon. We did just start, and there was a dragon. Oh, there we go. Need these. Those are important. And we gotta hit all these, but that's just like good to do. Oh, we can't jump over the little fence. Aww. Okay. But I'm being a Goomba. What could there be Goomba in? But I'm being. He's dead. Huge. Oop. Oh shit, it's close up when Mario's in danger, cause enemies to sometimes miss! I love some- Oh well, we don't have enough badge points for that just yet. So, you know, we'll have to save up. There we go. Oh my god, that's a lot of funny flying boys. I don't know when to do it for her, so she gets the stylish. This is set. To oh my god, can we get it? No. <laughs> Bada bing, it's a jump move. We're almost there, from 69 to 81. A couple more Goomba fights, and we might just fucking level up and see what happens then. Oh, it's a heart! And it heals us up from all the damage we took before. Bada bing. Okay, I got a sleepy sheep. Bada bing. Six whole star points? Holy shit, we're rolling in it. And I'm over. What's this do? Oh no. My my listing lazily controller made me uh 
bad at the video game. Where does this take me? Oh my god, how can I possibly get that? Oh, it must be impossible right now. Maybe we'll gain some kind of technique that'll allow us to obtain that just out of reach item. Oh, one more thing, Mario. If you ever find yourself, like, wondering what to do, just press X and use my tattle ability, okay? I might be able to look up some useful info that'll help us on our funny adventure. Alright, if you say so. Oh my god! This thing. Oh, I fucked it. I didn't turn around. I didn't, I didn't direction my attack move. Oh, I really want to, like, kill the spike one. <laughs> okay, we'll get the spike one. Soon enough. Don't let him guess which one you're attacking. You gotta keep him guessing. Don't let him guess your next move. Damn it. I was really I was going for the B that time, just to be uh, a silly guy about it. Hey! Huge! We got our one flower point back. It fills up the stage though. Yeah, look at all these dudes. Flower power points. Wait, that's 13. That's exactly lethal. <laughs> that's a level up. <gasps> Huge. We fucking look at Mario. He's going. Do we want? Do we want 15 health? Do we want 10 flower power? Or do we want 6 badge points? As if it's even a question. Of course we're going with the badge points. Look at this guy. We just got a badge. Oh, we got close call. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, no, fuck. I didn't mean to go down. I meant to, like, walk off. Let's go left. I don't think there is anything this way. Nope. <laughs> badge points. Absolutely badge points. You got the right idea. Bonk. Look at this. Look at this fucking amazing effect. This animation. Alright, whoop. Is there anything else over here? Oh my god, it's a star piece! Anything else? That's it. I don't know if I can listen to Mario go wah wah for like hours. Oh fuck. Coin! Coin! Oh my god, it's a box! Mystery! Who knows what this does? Take a chance and find out! Fire flower! Oh yeah. You have a maximum inventory, so there's no point in carrying too many items. You want to, like, use them, you know? <gasps> oh! Junk! We're in Petalburg! City of Splendors, that's what they call it. Welcome, travelers! Uh, where are you, you ask? Why, this is a Petalburg. Sorry, but it's been a long time since we've had visitors here. We're kind of remote. Yippity, once that dragon, Hooktail, was spotted flying around this area, well, it didn't help tourism that we didn't have an answer when people asked, what was it, dragon? People just stopped visiting. Dragon? Question mark? That must have been that huge thing we saw earlier, Ma Magic Mario. Magic Mario. <laughs> so it's called Hooktail, huh? Oh, scary name. Ooh. So anyway, Green Boots, have you ever heard- Some don't just fucking call the Koopa a slur. Just like, we just met the guy. He, he seems to be trying to be nice to us, Goombella. Things called Crystal Stars. We're on this quest for them. It's very important. Crystal Stars, you say? Hmm, nope. Can't say that I have. Sorry about that. You might want to speak up with the mayor, though. He's old. Really old. I thought she knows all kinds of stuff we don't know. Oops of his days are, um, smart. Anyway, the mayor lives in that pink house up ahead. You should go check it out. The pink house? Sounds totally hideous, but it should be easy to find. Thanks for your help. Oh, she fucking doesn't like pink. She's not like other Goombas. 
we got to say. Top of the morning, tis I, Bulbubber. I'm as happy as can be. Why? Simply because I'm surrounded by flowers. Man, you fucking, you for real. You're the real one. Is a shop? Is a save? It's save because, you know, just leveled up. That's important. Huge. There's a bomb guy. There's this dude. Oh, bonjour, mademoiselle. It is a beautiful day, no? No, 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 no. Not you, monsieur moustache. I am speaking to the lovely little cabbage behind you. Uh, what do you say? My pity abandons this dullard and come away with more. And then she says some slur, and then he speaks French, and then she she says, uh, I think, something that I can't repeat. Ah, oh, that's a pink house. That's probably what they meant. Lou is a girl Cooper. You can tell because it's a turtle. Turtle leaf. A leaf found in Petalburg. Requires 3 FP. Can I, like... Oh, wait, wait, wait. No. Can, can I, like... Fuck. <laughs> Can I? No, I hit the, the ceiling that time. I don't think I can. I can jump the fence. I think I'm gonna wait until I get the, the special move. All right, you're not gonna believe it. I'm Mario. What was it? Someone that? Who, who? What do you want from me? I know you're thieves here to rob a defensive old poor Puga. Despicable. Oh, right, go on. You you want the you want the star, the shell? I can't do without my memories or something. What about a thing? What thieves? Well, what's your story there? You looking for the crystal stars, eh? Oh well, if you're looking for the crystal stars, you're fucking dumbass. I hid those away myself. I put them up in the castle. The dragon's got them. I think he ate them. Um, an ordinary dragon eats folks. They say you know hooktail, right? Of course I know hooktail. We just talked about it. Well, this looks hooktail's brutal flyby snaggings of all the pins and needles. So are you reckless fools? I mean, are you gallant heroes off to rough it up? You got it. I'm gonna go fuck up that dragon. Uh, this does sound promising. Why, if you can rid us of hooktail, we'll shower you with gratitude and rewards. Wait, what's that I hear? You'll accept no reward? Uh, of course I won't. What an unselfish man. Noble indeed. Yup, a good egg. Now, what did you say your name was again? My name's Mario. Murphy? Oh, Alright, that's a fine name. Yeah. Uh, the name is Mario. I appreciate that, Murphy. They are nice eyebrows. Now listen up. If your intent is on going to Hook Hill's castle, find the secret pipe near the village. I don't know where it's at, but I know you need the stone keys to use that pipe. The keys are somewhere in Schwank Fortress. Just past the village. Get them first. <laughs> to name right old man. <laughs> oh, amazing. Well then, Murphy, get going and take care of that hooktail monster. Nah, he's too old. He doesn't know how to read. He can't. He can't even see. Let alone like, you see, he, his eyes have gone bad. He can't read the top text anymore as good as like anyone else can. Oh shit! I got an email. <laughs> you got an email. <laughs> Fucking, I'm blowing up. As you travel, you may receive an email from people you've met on your journey. You can read these emails on your mailbox SP. Press the start to access the menu and check your email. You'll find it under important things on your gear screen. Alright. Uh, gear. Important things. Mailbox SP. Uh, RDM register. Oh, frankly. Hello, Mario. Working hard or hardly working, am I right? Professor Frankly here, in e-form. It's highly likely you'll receive emails like this one while you're on your journey, so check your mail often. Actually, I have nothing more to say than that, so I hope all goes well for you, and I look forward to getting more information on those crystal stars. Professor Frankly, here's a picture of me with a bin. And now, here's Nardo telling you some in-game lore about that bin. So, in that bin, in his shop will be the Tattletale Pokédex entries for monsters that you've like fought and can't fight again. So if we, for example, did not tattle on the big bloop creature earlier, you can't fight him again ever again. So his Tattletale entry will be put in that trash can and you can go get it so you can still complete the whole Tattletale decks uh, in that thing. So there's a little tip for you. RDM registration, direct mail verification. Dear Mr. Mario, thanks for registering with Roadport Direct Mail RDM Services. Your kind friend, Mr. Frankly, referred you to us. Our direct mail service will provide you with regular timely news updates. We hope you enjoy our service. Published by Roadport Restoration Committee. Right, that's, that's all of our email. We've checked our email. Oh, what's good, my guy? Can you, can you fuck off? Uh, an old stronghold called Schwank Fortress lies ahead. A stone creature lives there. At least it might live there. Uh, this guy is to keep it out. My job is guarding the gate. But if the mayor says it's okay, I'll let you pass. Careful out there, though. There we go. Um, excuse me. Uh, I beg your pardon. Wait a moment, please. I'm just a pathetic little guy. I'm just a silly little dude. I got a band-aid on my nose. Pardon me for yelling like that. I was, uh, panicking. Um, how to begin? Well, first, my name's Coops. 
Ah, I've heard you're traveling to Hooktail's castle. <laughs> so anyway, I, uh, I have a favor to ask. Well, um... Oh, just forget it. Never mind. Ignore me. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> hey, why are you being mean? He's like autistic, Goombella. Jesus Christ, read the room. Oh my god. Fucking Goombella. Zero tolerance. Fucking a star piece. Holy shit, where'd that come from? Oh, <laughs> uh, this is a good game. <laughs> I don't, fucking, who would have guessed? Oh my god! He's got sunglasses! Alright, Gumbella. What's the Pokédex say about his power level? That's a Koopa Troopa! They've been around forever. Gotta respect the longevity. Their shells are hard, but so am I. Flip them over and their defense drops to zero. <laughs> Gumbella is actually beloved. <laughs> Well, no, she's not! She's a junior in, in university! I don't know how old that makes her, but she is, she is very mature. She's, like, old. How old are you when you're a junior in college? She is a junior in college! She goes to Goom's University! Go Goombas! She looked it up? What do you mean you looked it up? In- on what? Source. Because <laughs> Source, I made it up. I just- I was- I'm playing the game and I, I was reading the lore. Okay, so flip him over and you jump on him. That's how you beat a Goomba. You gotta jump on him. Oh, he's, he's dead. <laughs> how is she beloved and in university? Do Goombas age at a different rate or something? Five star points! Huge! Oh, some flower power. The interact button and the jump button being the same button. Silly. Oh, I was trying to jump on him. <laughs> of course I'm right! She goes to the university! <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what can you say? <laughs> no, she's all gear. That's all. That's her whole body. What do you mean? <laughs> she's entirely gear. That's what she bonks them with. It's her main form of, of, of offense. It's her self-defense mechanism. Level one yet. <gasps> I like how the standard Koopa Troopa is just like men with sunglasses. Get him with the gap. And then we just, you know, stomp this Koopa into the ground. In a non-offensive way, obviously. Fucking sleepy sheep, hell yeah! Oh, <gasps> power block, that's enormous. It's actually, I think, really important for the level. Look at these funny dudes! Look how silly they look! It was good, guys. I don't think I'm gonna do it. I think they have like two defense. Alright, use your Pokedex, quick. Alright, okay, that's a bald cleft. Basically, a rock monster with a swarthy looking face. Uh, it's kind of mean. 
What the fuck are you- You're so prejudiced, Gumbella, against fucking everyone. You always got something to say. Now she hates the bald. Max HP is 2, attack is 1, and defense is 2. Yeah, this guy's rock solid. Fire doesn't even hurt it. It might be best to attack it with, say, a uh, pow block? Uh, got that thing. What do you mean? <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, clearly we're just gonna power smash him. Or we get piercing smash him as well. I think this does 4 damage. I think it's equivalent. Fucking <laughs> got dizzied. Does this just mean my attacks might miss? I mean, I kind of don't want to do anything if my attack is gonna miss. Ah, I'll just, I'll just bet it all. <laughs> Can you not use an item? Yes, there it is. Hurtly. What are the odds that I miss twice in a row, right? Okay. Oh, fuck. Gotta get that guy out of here. He didn't pay. The dead. Can't grip of You have prejudice on these enemies, that's what he has. Is it behind here? Gotcha. you disable all of them. And they can't do anything. Damn. He's dead. Bunch of dead Koopa boys. Just silly little guys. Conan? Oh, when he punches the camel? <gasps> the power block! I don't like the look of these guys, I'll be honest. I'm like with, I might side with Gumbella on this one if she becomes prejudiced against these guys. Alright, what's the- what does the book say about their tattle score and all that? That's a bristle! Totally covered in spikes! They're so prickly! Max HP is 2, attack is 1, and defense is 4! That's too much! And they're impervious to fire! Even trying to get close enough to whack it with a hammer is dangerous! Seriously, his spikes will totally pop out and stab you dead! So since you can't jump on it or use your hammer, you better use an item. 
Oh, you know, I've been picking up these power blocks. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> 14 star points. What a funny power block. Ooh, a conundrum. I don't know if I'm allowed to walk by him. I can't walk by him, so we are gonna have to endure a wing, a winging, I guess. From the old spiky boy. Uh, even with the block, he still gets—he still chips one through, you know. He chips one damage through. We're gonna have to increase our defense somehow, maybe with badge points. Damn. That would've been good, we were low on flower power. Up to 60, we're almost level 3! Holy shit, we're getting there. Oh, we needed one of these. Conan? Remember the wizard? Sixty-seven! Huge. And an in coupon. Yes. Oh, it's a full heal for five coins. I kinda don't want to spend five coins. <laughs> I'm a bit stingy, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to spend five. Those are my five coins. And how how badly am I even? Going? Eight out of ten, three out of five. What am I even paying five coins for? Fuck off! It's not worth it. Let's save right now. Yes. I do have all my badges equipped, right? That's the most important part. I can't have like any of the badges not equipped. What is this guy? What do you think this guy's about? A wah! What? Hoo-ha! You're the first contestants I've seen in a while. If you've come all the way here to Shuang Fortress, you must want stone keys. And if that's the case, then you must compete against me. If you win, I'll let you through to where the stone keys rest. However, if you lose, you will suffer a terrible fate. And by terrible, I mean awful. So, what do you want to do? I'll take you on. You're in for it now! Oh shit. We're gonna be on a popular reality TV game show. Hey, hey, ladies and gentlemen, welcome everybody to the 60th Super Fun Quirk Quiz! Perk up those ears if you correctly answer five of the following questions, you win! But get three of them wrong and you'll suffer a cruel and unusual punishment. Now, for the first question. What's hidden in this place? That's the stone key. It's the pickle stone! It's the stone keys. Is that your real answer? Are you sure? Yeah. <laughs> that was the one! Oh, that's correct! Ah, oh, question was too easy, but it only gets harder from here, like me! Much harder! So, prepare yourself. On to question two! What do one Mr. Softener and one Fireflower cost at the shop in Petalburg total? I didn't even step foot in the shop. What do you think? From home. Get guesses from, from the audience. Anyone. 10 coins, 12 coins, 16 coins, 20 coins. What could it possibly be? I'm rec I reckon it's 12 coins. Well, no, okay. So, like, a Fireflower is probably 10 coins by itself. I don't know what a Mr. Softener is. I say 16, because I bet it's like 6 for one, 10 for the other, right? Surely that's how much it should cost. That makes sense, right? 
The fire flower seems expensive. I'm gonna go 16 coins. Holy shit, I was right. That's correct. That question was too easy, but it only gets harder from here. Much harder. So prepare yourself. Moving on, question three. What is the name of the mayor of Petalburg? What was that old guy's name? It's not Couscous. It's not Bertle. It's not Moopa. That seems kind of like, you know. I think it's Croup. Or Bertle. I'm gonna go Croup. Yeah, that's Croup. Oh, that's correct. Oh, uh, question was too easy, but it was harder from here, much harder. To prepare yourself. We're not done yet, folks. Question four. Tell me now, where is the crystal star? Uh, uh, uh the dragon has it. There's Hooktail Castle. <laughs> oh, right again. Tell me you didn't just get your fourth right answer. It can't be true. That's it. I'm making the rest of these near impossible. Get ready for brain pain. Are you ready for the diabolical question five? How can one get from Petal Meadows to Rogueput? Uh, I'm, I'm sure you could get that. Oh, only by air? No, you go through a pipe. Is that your real answer? Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, sure. That's how I got here. You just took a pipe. No, that's right. You correctly answered five questions and I believe it, you win. <gasps> and then he died. That kills him. So, uh, very angry. I can't believe I lost. I guess I have to let you through stupid rules. Burf. No, I guess we'll save just so we don't have to do that again. In case it all goes bad. Anything behind you? Wow. Oh my god, it's a multi bounce! Jump on all foes in a row with perfect action commands. Okay. Multi bounce on. Uh, let's go left then right. What the fuck is this little creature? I don't like him! Oh my god, he's still alive. What does this scouter say? That's a fuzzy! What a hyper little guy, huh? Cut back on the caffeine. Max HP is 3, attack is 1, defense is 0. Those things suck up your HP and use it to replenish their own. Isn't that the worst? I mean, ew, doesn't that sound totally gross? Anyway, guard against them by pressing A. The moment they release you, the timing is pretty hard to master, so uh, practice up. These things really suck HP. Got it. They're all dead. I just don't want the last one doing the funny meme. Doing a fire flower, you know? That'd be bad. <laughs> there you go. I think I could do with a, uh... Nah, I'm fine. Yeah. Yeah. Huge! Ah, oh, Fire Flower! <laughs> Enormous! That's like super handy for all these guys. It, like, kills them dead. 
Moonstone. Oh, it's like four of them. Jeez, what could we possibly do? What a fight! Hell yeah! Back to full flower power. Cool. Just like me. <laughs> Three of them. I'll try this multi bounce. Like, does it mean like one each? Yeah, it does mean like one each. I think that's enough! That's a level up! Oh my god, what do you what do you think we should go for? We could choose we could choose health? We could choose flower power? We choose health? We choose badge points! Oh we gotta go with the we gotta go with the badge points. Look at this! Bada bing! We're gonna get so many badge points. Get over here, you silly little coins. Oh, we got him. We don't want him sleepy sheeping us, you know? It's dangerous. No fuzzy should need an assault sheep like that. Being. He's dead, like a dog in the dark. Oh, it's all done. He's trying to. Oh fuck! I, I missed. <laughs> I fucked up the timing. This has never happened before in my life. It's gone. I've, I've become a fraud, a failure even. <laughs> I've let down the community. I'm like my eight-point apology video to to start. Uh, probably tomorrow, I'd say. I didn't mean for the fuzzy to suck me off. Oh my god, this is a funky one. Can't flee this fight. Oh no. What are we possibly gonna do? What a good move. Up to 21 XP already. Rolling in it. We level 4 in no time. Oh, it's a funky golden one. Me orc! Hey, you suspicious types. This is our place, and coming in here is rude, rude, rude. Sorry, suckers. If you want a warm welcome, too bad. Now I lunch on your head. Let me suck you off. Good. That's what he's gonna say. He just he called, he called Mario gay and tried to suck him off. That's a gold fuzzy! Whoa, those are super rare. I'm serious. Wow. Max HP is 10, attack is 1, defense is 0. Oh, but hey, even though it's a fuzzy, it won't suck you off for HP, which is nice. I have to wonder though, how does this thing hide? Look at it, it's so gaudy. Oh my god, disgusting. Alright, let's have a look at the power smash. Let's look at the bash his brains in. Oh, I got fucked up the timing on that. So cool. That's what he does! He's a suck-off guy. Suck guy! He lives in the sewers, and he sucks dudes off. That's what he does. Look at him. That's the face that does that. 
tougher than you look. But I'm not through yet, everyone! Get them! Oh no, there's too many! There's like a billion! Can you buy one real quick? Oh, fuck. They got one. They got one in. Oh, I thought he was gonna, like, latch onto me. Ooh, that's a bit, that's a bit spicy. I mean, I could fire flower here. As, as a treat, you know? As a little treat, I could fire flower here. I'm gonna fire flower as a little treat. I think if I just, like, eat the shit out of the main guy, I win. Nice, nice. Nice, strong, brave. Alright, here we go. Mario's gotta steal the show. Bada bing, he's dead. That's 20 whole XP! We didn't let those dudes suck us off. Really, you got me! <laughs> Man, fuck off. Stay out. We defended Mario's wing. I mean, save. Okay, so now that we got the two rocks, we can head to the castle, like the old Goomba man said. I mean, the old Koopa man said, yeah. We gotta fight our way there, you know? Okay, not to be that guy, but... Look, why, why is the entire audience Koopas? It must be the demographic of the area. How many of you guys out there are Goombas? <laughs> just to, you know, just to get a, a, a thing. Oh fuck, I fucked it. <laughs> fucked my timing because I was making a shit joke. There you go! Six whole stars. Hand over the juice. Gotcha. And then he dies. Alright, can I like super timing this? Yes. It's really hard though. I got nervous there for a second. <laughs> 51 star boys already. Rolling in it. I want like a like a jump move that deals more damage, you know? Cause I got I got like power smash for the hammer, but if I want to deal like a lot of damage to a jumping to, to through jumping, I don't gotta I don't gotta mean for that. Hey. No. <laughs> it was the whole perspective, the three point perspective fucked me up. Gotta be Dead. But I mean, enormous dead. Oh, fuck. oh shit! <laughs> really, just trying to jump on the boy. I've never seen an attack from them, so watch out. Oh, I fucked it. Do you think there's like a percentage chance that they get up? It'd be like a fun, a fun mechanic. Oh, 
I imagine if we had like a cool like, a Koopa guy as a friend. We could have him tank for us with his one defense. It'd be huge. We'd still need Goombella to like digitize all the Digimon to add to the Pokedex and all that, you know? Bam. He's dead. Hit him right in the gear. This is a Goomba, the whole thing's a gear. You know what I'm saying? You get what I mean? Bada bing! There it goes! That's a health and a dead man. <laughs> oh, he's got a power block! Huge. He does go Waku sometimes. Bada bing! One million. Oh, dude, a power block. Hell yeah, that's super useful. Damn. <laughs> ah, to be a Goomba. Also dead. I think this is the best implementation of turn based combat in any video game ever. I don't think I'm being hyperbolic. <laughs> she hit him in his hyperbolics, if you know what I'm saying. Bonk, and I headbutted him right in there. Are we there? We did it. You wanna stop by the town shop? Does the shop sell anything cool? If they sell badges, I'm fucking... That'd be great. Love a, love a nice badge. <laughs> sell me some badges. <laughs> Did you see that creature? Like a flower face. They did have a shop right here. Check it out. We'll save after the shop. You're a Mr. Softener. Oh no, they're each cost eight. What's a courage shell? You sell badges? Exclamation of shop points. Customers earn one shop point for each item they buy. As you build up your points, you earn various prizes, including rare items. The prizes are explained inside each individual store, and that's it. Need to hear it again? No, that's okay. Excellent. You're now free to shop, sell, or store items, please. What can I do here? I'm here to buy, sell, store, withdraw. Just checking points. I'm here to buy. Okay. What's the gold liquid? It's piss. Uh, checking points. What do I earn for points? I have a, Yeah, I have zero, but like... 10 points, I get a mushroom. I get some jamming jelly at 250 points. Holy shit. There we go. Three gold bars at 300 points. Yeah, these all seem bad. <laughs> honey syrup, restores 5 a a FP. It says honey syrup, but we know it, it, it does look like piss. <laughs> uh, we'll buy some, a little bit of piss. No, we won't. No, I didn't care about you, small person. You know the N64, right? Well, the game I play most on it is Paper Mario. There's this girl in the game, Bao, who's pretty much the cutest boo of all time. He's got a waifu. Oh my god, what a, what a little zoomer guy. He's got his, his own waifu. He plays Genshin Impact. Look at him. What a silly little guy. Alright, we're off to go see a dragon and ask him what they are. Uh, excuse me! Oh jeez, it's Mario, right? Look, I am... Um, see, the thing is, I've been waiting here in the hope of getting to speak with yous. I have to ask you something, and you can say no, but I'm gonna throw it out there. You see, I got a weird dick. Um, see, I was wondering, would you... Oh, please take me with you to fight Hooktail, please! I'm begging you, I wanna kill a dragon! <laughs> Sorry about that. See, my dad, he went off to battle Hooktail long ago, but he never came back. 
I miss him, of course. I miss him badly, but this isn't just about avenging my dad. Well, no, that's not true. Revenge is part of it, I guess. A big part. But the truth is, I wanted to finish what my dad started for his sake, for everyone's sake. I want to I wanna know what it's dragging. Ah, uh, man, this is embarrassing. See, everyone always says I'm a crybaby, a weakling. But if I can defeat Hooktail, well, I won't be those things. I'll be strong like my dad. I know it'll be dangerous. Sure, come along. For real? No kidding. Yes, thank you so much. You'll stay in the front. I oh, freaking Google just hopped in my pants. Coops has joined your party. Coops abilities: A. Primer. Press X to shoot out his shell. Use it to retrieve distant items and hit switches. Wow! Like a boomerang. If you hold X, you can hold his shell in one place after shooting it. After holding his shell in place, release X to fire the shell past Mario and attack. Sounds pretty wacky. You can even hold Koop's shell in place, move Mario around, and then release the shell. Seems pretty wacky. So remember, hold X to shoot the shell out and hold it in one place. In battle, Koops can fight by your side, striking foes with his main move, the Shell Toss. He can also strike all ground-bound enemies in one attack with his Power Shell. He's a programmer. To swap your partner in the field, press the Start and Pause button and go to the party menu. Well, we're going to keep Koop around for now because... Okay, Mario, let's get going. Koops! Oh my god, Koops, it's your sister. Oh golly, um, hi, Koopy Koo, did you overhear all that? Well, part of it, Koops, I thought I heard you say you're off to fight Hooktail. But you're joking, right? I mean, you're not exactly a powerhouse. It'll fucking kill you, mate. <laughs> I know, Koopy Koo, but I want to be tougher for you, my sister. So I have to do this. No, Koops, you don't. I mean, going off to somewhere is dangerous. It's... It's stupid, it's suicide! So what if you're timid and sort of a crybaby? I don't care about that, I'm your sister after all! I just want you to be you, so don't go! Sorry Koopy Koo, I've made up my mind. No need to worry though, after all, I'm traveling with Mario. He's the man, he certainly killed thousands of dragons in his day. Fine, ignore me! Ah, stubborn Koopa! I'm sorry Koopy Koo. I swear to you, I will come back to you a stronger Koopa, my dear sweet sister. That's what he said. Well, Mario, that's that, I guess. No turning back. Hooktail's castle awaits. That's pretty funny. You know what? Wait over there, Koopa. Kill this guy, Koops. Oh, I was hoping he'd like super to come back from around the world and kill him instantly. Let's try out that funny move. Let's try out... No, no, he's gonna throw. He's gonna throw a coin. Yeah. Power shell for three flower. Po oh, we share flower power. Bullshit. <laughs> we'll try it anyway. Hold left and release with good timing. I guess that's good timing. Yeah, you, you monster. Until you kill those guys. We definitely like level up before we get to the castle, right? Six. Basically all dead. Oh, what's up here, though? Happy Heart. Slowly and automatically restore HP during battle. Oh my god. That's a great badge. Fucking wang that on. That's two, that's two BP needed for that one, though. But, you know, they're getting a little expensive there. Got him. He's dead. You see, Koops is my gun. <laughs> I shoot him at the enemy. 
Koops is my god. There's many like him. And by god is there many like him. But he's mine. <laughs> Boom, he's dead. Normal hammer. Enormous. Six more! Six away from leveling off! You guys excited to get more badge points? I mean, you know, it could be anything. <laughs> okay, so... Stick the sunstone in there. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Stick the moonstone in there. Cool, cool, cool. What's this? Words? Okay, something, something. I'm sure it said something. Wait over there, groups. Oh my god! It's like a Darksiders puzzle. <laughs> so dumb. The fuck are you saying, Coops? Now, I don't remember if a certain NPC has moved, so I'm gonna quickly go check that out before uh, before going into the castle. Just as a little, you know, if you'd indulge me. A huge waste of time if I'm wrong, by the way. No! Stop it, controller. Okay. Should be easy sailing from here. Check right in here. They did! They did move! Look at them! They're right here! Hey! My name's Dazzle, and I collect star pieces. The more I collect, the, the larger I become. So, guy, if you have any star pieces, I'll trade you my badges for them, eh? What do you say? Come on, let's trade. I'll do it. Which badge do you want to trade for? Give me fucking all of them. Oh, they need like 15 for these! Boost Mario's jump and hammer attacks by one! That's so many more! Okay, what are the other ones? Uh, quick change? Allow your ally to attack even after changing partners. Now that's pretty damn good. Item hog? Make it likelier that items will appear after battle. Uh, happy heart? Slowly and automatically restore HP during battle. Uh, pretty lucky when Mario's attacked, cause enemies to sometimes miss. Ooh, chill out. Never succumb to a first strike. That's okay. And attack FXY. Change the sound effect of Mario's attacks. Alright, I'm gonna take none of them because I wanna get 15 so I can get these, and I forgot that they needed so many drop FP used for Mario attacks by one. Oh, that could be freaking pretty, pretty nice. But I would I would love like 15 star star boys for that. So that's what I'm saving up for. So once we have 15 star boys. We gotta go back, we gotta come back there and go get him. But now we know that that's there, so if we do get 15 Star Boys, maybe we get 15 Star Boys in the castle. Who knows? Who knows? You know? Okay, off to the castle. This time for real. Sorry, I'm, 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 I'm reading a bit. It's a very important bit. Okay. I was, I was just reading the entire, um... Uh, entire My Hero Academia anime. Just write that in there. I just wanted to get, read the, the last thing real quick. <laughs> yeah, right. Spending money for healing. Who would ever? 
What do I look like? Wait a minute. I think there's a, a meme here. If I go down, I think there's a thing I can look at. Wait, we have to go back. Oh man, Hoop Day Sauces, the stories are all true. This place is terrifying. Alright, we have, we do have to go back though, Coops. I think there's a bit down there that we have to go check out. Yes, it is here. Legend is true. <laughs> HP plus, increase maximum HP by five! Oh, that's enormous! We're kind of getting low on HP. Oh, we need three BP for this. All right, what do we not like? I like multi-bounce. I haven't found a use for piercing, honestly, so we'll get that one. Once we level up, we'll get more badge points and we can put it, the other one back on, so that's, that's fine. You know? Yeah, that's why we need to come down down here. That's important. Here we go. What I mean? Open door. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna want. We're gonna want girl, Umba, so she can like di digi scan any new enemies we might see, like this guy. Okay, I guess I guess we can get the jump on him. Oh, there's a lot of them. That's a Koopa Paratroopa! Well, um, it's a Koopa Troopa with wings. Max HP 4, attack is 2, and defense is 1. I kinda hate that this guy gets to fly. Of course you can stomp on him and he'll plunge down and be a plain Koopa Troopa. Yeah, do that, and he's ours. Stomp again to flip him and his arms and legs are useless. Oops, sorry, that's not true. It looks like he can still wiggle them around a bit. Yeah. The multi-bounce will just knock them all to the ground. The, this thing will at least disable one of them. Ooh, it'd still take one damage from that. Oh, we got Wang pretty hard. Oh, but we HP regen! Troll blood! Troll blooded Mario with the HP regen! Enormous. I mean, if these guys are going to be the enemies we're going to be fighting in here, we probably want Kumbella, honestly, over Koops. I'm yeah, just keeping the saber, you know? Bam. I wonder if, like, there's actual skill to that instead of, like, random. It feels like a. Like, it is rotating and, like, actually rotating. Like, you can't time it. Oh, fucking HP regen's enormous. Oh my god, that's a level up. We're gonna get more badge points! <laughs> Huge! Rolling in it. I mean, it could be HP, it could be flower power, but we all know it's badge points! <laughs> oh, absolutely. That's the best one. Why do we even play this game? We'll play it for badge points. <laughs> Put this piercing glow back on, why not? Monk. Oh fuck. I was just two dudes. It's just two little guys. Go, go stomp them in the yard. Fucking like HP region. Enormous. Polish that guy off. I'm gonna go swim with the piranha plants. It's like a fish because it's a piranha. Oh, they're all dead. 
huge seven. We're basically gonna level up again. Moon shoes. Power bounce. Jump on one enemy until you miss an action command. I could kill a man. Badges. Three. What is it? Okay, what are we getting rid of? I'm not too impressed by multi bounce, but I can see it being useful. I'm gonna get rid of piercing blow and go for power bounce. Good thing we leveled up to get all those the needed BP for that one. Fuck! We got hit. Damn it, I was trying to parry. Should we go for a power bounce just to see how, how good we are at it? Oh, I fucked it. I fucked it right at the end. Killed him. Oh, I shouldn't have... I'm just misplaying everywhere! For the disables, man. Meaning to disable them, not go for the dis. <laughs> you know what I mean. Uh, kill a man. You think you recognize someone, Coops? What are you saying? These bones, they remind me of my dad. He had bones just like these, I remember. There's there's no doubt about it. It's definitely my dad's bones. No! What we'll cry? Wait, what's this? Mario, he's holding some kind of letter, or at least uh, his bones are. So, uh, what should I do? Should I read it? Yeah, go fucking read the letter, man. Go, go on. Okay, I can do this. Uh, I'll read it. Ahem. I came to this castle to destroy Hooktail, but I am stuck and can go no further. So in this letter I shall note Hooktail's weakness for those who follow. The dread Hooktail cannot tolerate creatures that begin with kr and end with ikit. Hidden somewhere in this castle is an item related to Hooktail's weakness. If one is to have any hope of defeating Hooktail, one must first find that item. One last thing, if faced with ultimate doom, the fiend will use any trick to save itself. If you hope to defeat it, do not give in your in your kinder nature and fall for its tricks. Alas, I do not have the strength to continue writing already. Mist veils my eyes. My last words go to my son, Colorado. I love you, and I'm proud of who you've become. Huh? My son, Colorado. Not Coops? I guess it's not my dad. <laughs> this, this isn't my dad at all. This is just a skeleton. <laughs> but if this isn't my father, I wonder what that pile of bones over there is my dad, maybe. <laughs> Fuck oops. Yeah, maybe it's this red one. Blar far 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 far. If you clearly don't value your lives much if you've come to this castle to disturb us, you will go no farther and from this moment on you'll be nothing but bones. <laughs> What are they doing? Ouch, it's no use Mario, they're all over me, man. What should we do? Well, first... We're gonna bust our way through. There we go. Can't flee this fight. Oh, that's fine. Tell me the Pokedex on the red bones. That's a red bones. A little too red, I think. What do you mean? You can't just judge someone based on the color of their bones. No fashion sense, you know? 
Max HP is 5, attack is 3, and defense is 1. Unlike your average dull bones, even if you pound it to 0 and it crumbles, it totally might revive, like a zombie. My advice is to get rid of the dull bones, then attack the red bones. Oh, and one more thing. Once its friends start to fall, it may create some more. Alright, if you say so. Uh, what funny items do we have? We got this POW block. Maybe this will do something. building another dude. Alright, you're gonna have to read the Pokedex entry for this Dull Bones. That's a Dull Bones, sort of a skeleton thing. It was a Koopa Trooper. Once. Max HP is 1, attack is 2, and defense is 1. These creeps throw bones to attack. Oh, and they build reinforcements too. Attacks that can strike multiple Dull Bones at once are the most effective. Let's just fucking wang this guy then, don't we? What the fuck? Why'd you just hit Goomba like that? And he's... what? Ow. Uh... Well, you can't hurt it because he has two defense. Or one defense or something, so... Just power smash him? Huge! 22 XP! That's enormous! Get the fuck out of here! That's right, that's what I thought! Okay, which one of these funny boys? Oh shit, there's a lot of them. Oh, they only got the 1 HP. Okay, what's your normal attack look like? Hold left. And release with good timing. Okay. Huge, we're out of flower power though. A little troubling sometimes. As getting us out of a bind once or twice. Ooh, a meme. A shine sprite, a mysterious powerful object collecting these will help. Oh, we got these guys. He's dead. Huge. The key up there. Meme over here and a purple one there. Okay, I see. I see what's happening. So I'll do this, right? And then I'll get on this, and then I'll let it go. And then I can go in here, and then it's a star piece. Huge. I think I've missed several. Call that back down. You hold there. Jump's doable, isn't it? That's definitely a doable jump. I've seen that jump be doable. Yeah. Star piece. Okay, we're, what are we up to? 11? That's pretty alright. Surely this must lead the good way. Nope. <laughs> and this flips. Bada bing. Oh, 
Castle Key! Alright. Castle Key! In we go. Always check your horizontal before you check your vertical, I reckon. I think that's the good meme. Oh, that's not great. Mm, we're out of flower power. We can't do anything too fancy. Don't use the power block. Oh, since he's a Koopa Troopa, he has one defense innately, so we're set. Man, fuck that guy. He threw a can at Koops. Could be considered a hate crime. If it was the jump or the coop, little coops that hit him. It was coops. Nice. Ah, oh, coops can't hit these guys. Oh, what's worse? I think the dizzy is worse. Yeah, he's dead now. What are you gonna do? Defend. Uh oh. The dizzy dial. Oh, I need I need that, but I don't remember how to get everywhere else. Oh wait, 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 wait. no, clearly. I, I remember now. But we don't have a black key. Oh, surely it must be through here. It's like this way, and then this way, we go up. I think we got it. Black key, but we're gonna die. Oh, we better hurry up. Quick! Run! Run, Mario! Run! You don't got much time! Jeez, you only got 45 minutes! You're gonna die for sure, Mario! I fucked it. That's not the wrong way. This, you're gonna die for real, Mario! This time it's all gone! Oh no! You only got 30 seconds left! We gotta make it to the door! It's like 29, 28! Yeah, let's just leave. Man, that was too close! Gotta shake it off. Whew, okay, we got the key, so let's open that spooky chest. You're absolutely right, let's open the spooky chest. What? <laughs> what the heck? Hey, guests, it's been a long time since anyone came here. A real long time. Huh? You heard me? Wow. Wait a sec. If you can hear my voice, you must be some legendary hero or something. Or not. To be honest, I'm sure anyone with ears can hear me. But it sure is fun zinging people with that whole legendary hero bit. Hey, but seriously, folks. I was wondering if you could let me out of this chest. I've been locked in here so long, I'm starting to cramp. Up like you wouldn't believe. All you have to do is find the key and let me out. Easy. Huh? What do you mean? You think you'll be cursed if you open the box? Ridiculous. Who would do that, really? Wait, in a box and curse folks? A real slime ball, that's who. But I'm not a real slime ball, and I would do no such thing, but that should be obvious. 
I trust him. Look, if you help me out, maybe I'll help you out. You know, a little scratch your back, you scratch mine. Except in reverse order. Of course, you don't have to if you really don't want to. Like, finding a... Yeet is hard. Hey there. Boy, am I so glad you found that key. Unbelievable. Oh, here we go. Wee hee hee hee! Fools! Ah, oh, we got tricked again, guys. Who would have thunk it? Why only the most idiotic pudding brain dolt would fall for a scheme like that? The castle stripes prevent anyone who's entered this place from ever leaving it. No matter which path you take, you're fated to waste away to a slow, painful death in the end. But wait, there's more to this great deal. I'll throw in a free curse, no charge. Oogly googly boo! That's him. Wee hee hee hee! Now you're cursed, doofus, and it serves you right! This curse is more cursedly curse worthy than any curse that's ever cursed you! For this curse makes you like a piece of paper when you press and hold R. Wee hee hee! What a curse! Who curses like me? No one. Now I shall show you just how frightful a curse it is. Go on, press and hold R. Press and hold R now! Oh shit, I'm anorexic. You idiot, press and hold! Press and hold! And be ashamed. Okay, I'm holding it, man. Wee hee hee! Just look at yourself, I'm embarrassing for you. Eat a sandwich, skitty. Hee! Do you understand what this curse means for you? Yes. Then farewell, you dumbbells. Wee hee hee hee! That's awesome, now we can go through like little thin bits. Like this. You can go like, ba ba ba, ba ba ba. You can go into this size house. You're like, hey. What's it to you? And we just leave. And we go through here. And we get the attack FXR. Change the sound effects of Mario's attacks. I believe that's a badge. So, badge go on. It's free! Wait. Change the sound effects of Mario's attacks. So, what does it sound like now? Is that a... It sounds like something that starts with crit and ends with icket. What do you guys think? I think it's, I think it's what I said. There was another key that was left behind over here that we can go- Oh yeah, let's save so we don't have to like repeat that meme again. There's a funny little bit over here. Excuse me. Yeah, see there's a key in there. Castle key. Enormous for the account. I think we go up the green one now. I think that's the next step. Can't even get that! Oh my god, how, how on... how on Jiminy Crickets do we get that one? Empty dub. Impos impossible. Open please. Castle key. Use on door. There we go. A heal? Absolutely not. I wish I could build that. Oh, look at that. That's a beam out there. Jump out the window. This is a star piece. Huge. Oh yeah, right. <laughs> the whole point of the window. Here we go. He's dead. Oh, good thing too, he had a, he was fucking strapped. Do you see that fire flower in his pocket? Dead boy. Okay. 
killed in action all those funny boys. Your life, your life. No. Okay. Up we go. No, don't don't fall off, Mario. Ooh, he was a fa he was faking. I saw the look on his dead face. Instantly dead. I don't think we have a key to open that door. Really? I've lost track. I've lost the plot. <laughs> I think we're gonna keep going until we kill Hooktail, I reckon. I think that's a, a good a good one. He's dead. Dead forever. Like a dog in the dark. What a good game. It's locked. Can't open it. So we definitely have to go this way. What is this? Mouse? Oh my, who's this handsome piece of ass? I can't believe it, there are other thieves here besides me. How very strange. Hey, who, who are you? Me? Well, I'm Miss Mouse, the globe-trotting thief. Heard of me, sweet cheeks? I heard there were rare and valuable badges here in this castle. That's why I'm here. But the real question is, why are people like you roaming in such a run-down place? Um, well, you see, we're here to beat Hooktail and uh, get a crystal star. So, uh, don't think we'll let you get the crystal star first. What the fuck are you saying, Coops? Crystal star, you say? Hmm. I didn't think a thing like that was hidden in this castle. Sounds intriguing. Perhaps I just heard something you didn't want me hearing. <laughs> French. Darn. Ah, oh, that's okay. I mean, you're looking for a crystal star first. I already found the badge I was after, so I'll let you get your funny joke meme. Oh, stay back, I have a, I, I'm, I got a hammer. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Oh my god, I was assaulted! Mario, self-defense, quick! Hmm, it means I must say bye-bye for now! Mustache? I know it's sad, we just met already, it's time to say farewell. Goodbye! <laughs> oh, I almost forgot, I have a little secret to share with you. Somewhere in this castle is a badge that'll help you beat Hooktail, or so I've heard. I don't know what kind of badge it is, maybe you found it already, maybe not. If you're going to fight Hooktail, I recommend finding that badge first. Well, take care, handsome mustache man. Let's get together again real soon. But Mario gonna fucking fuck a mouse. That's, that's nuts. I wonder what her story is. I bet it's an interesting one, full of dogs. Oh, look, a chest. Mushroom. Castle key. I needed that. Ah, piss! And a shine sprite! Ah, oh, it's like rolling in it now. Okay, cool. Now we can just go to the other side. Castle key. Got it. He's dead for sure now. Dead. Never get that. Huge. We're at seventy nine already. We're gonna level up before we get there. <laughs> and I like ran into it. Ah, oh, how handy! <laughs> oh, 
a rock into a theater of some kind of death sport. I mean, you know, actually, to be fair, now that I'm saying it out loud. 85! We're basically level 9 or whatever. Speed. It's like a fight away. Controller's weakness. Or is it just me? <laughs> no! <laughs> Why am I so bad at video games? <laughs> Please. Yes! Okay, we did it. In we go. Oh, you know what, but at least, at least that one thing, that one guy. Wait, actually, can we, like, meme you? Like, meme you back? I doubt it. Yeah, we want to go down, actually. Cause we wanna get this guy. My stand P. Drop the damage your ally takes by half when in danger. But now we can't actually uh, send this back up, so we have to go the long way back around. Uh, this thing is a meme. All right, quick, fast forward. Go, quick one. It was worth a badge point. I just wanted the funny badge. I just want a hundred percent Paper Mario. <laughs> Pfft. 
Fuck hoops. <laughs> Stop walk, trying to walk off. There we go, there we go. And we're back. Here. <laughs> Sprite! <laughs> oh, yeah. Normous. Oh, we're in like the castle ramparts. Oh my god. We got like none left. Drop the damage reality. We already have that. One. Fuck! <laughs> oh my god, this is this is this is a pretty bad situation they find themselves in. But since we're at 95, we're gonna get a full redo anyway. So might as well just fucking go nuts on boy. What? I hit A. It's, it's a level, it's a level boy! Look at Mario go! It can be health, it can be flower power, but it's badge points all the same every time. What a, what an actual hero. Holy shit. Put that one on, put piercing blow back on. Just want to equip every badge I find. There's like three of them. Look at multi bounce. Yeah. What does this do? What does that do? Defense. It'll still, like, knock you on your butt, though, disabling you, even if you have high defense. You can't ignore your base mechanics, Koopa Troopa. Say every day. Scooby <laughs> Troopers wake up in the morning and scream, yeah. 
Oh no, this is the one time I'm actually gonna get the damn thing because I'm unlucky. Oh no, good, 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 good. Oh no, it fell off the side of everything. I think we're about to see what this guy's dragging. That's a bingo! Fuck, <laughs> oh that never happens. <laughs> Goombaing. All right, let's just see if we can parry him. Damn. <laughs> it works out. That's the one. Bada -bing, bada -bing. Oh my god! Five whole star points. Lousy with them. Alright, just to be on the safe side, it is the boss fight. Let's fucking use the heal. Yeah, I know what it does. Did, did it happen? No. Give me the damn heal. Save. Alright. Yeah, Gubella, you gotta start with the, the Gubella. Got all the badges that we're gonna have. Oh, we have one more badge slot. We don't have any more badges, though, so. I mean, this is it. This is, this is, we're going in. We're going in hard and heavy. We got the... We got our, our hammer. We got a pair of shoes. How hard could one dragon be? Oh shit. What are they dragging? <laughs> this is a pretty big dragon. We're gonna have to dodge roll and use our iframes and everything. Oh, is there a friend of the strange who came earlier? I expect more to come to steal the treasure I protect. Such rudeness! I was foolish, I fear! Do you really think you can beat me? But you're so small, and you don't appear tasty. I suppose you might make a good snack. And the bottoms of your feet smell like they might make a good sauce with some spices. What the fuck are you saying, Michael Zaki? What I'll do is saute you to crispy goodness and gobble you down head first! Is, is, was this dragon goblin? This dragon's gonna gobble us down? Oh no. Snack time, little appetizers, but which one of you morsels should I taste first? Well, clearly, it's Goombella. That's Hooktail! Max HP is 20, attack is 5, defense is 1. It'll stomp and munch on you, and it has a more, more dragonish attack, stinky, fiery breath. It's tricky, especially when it's losing, it'll try to fool you into being merciful. Oh yeah, and one more thing, it hates things that start with crit and end with icket. Supposedly there's something related to that somewhere in this castle. Did we find it? Uh, I believe we did. I'm gonna power smash your big toe. Blech, that awful sound! It sounds like a cricket! How did you know? Stopped at this instant. Ugh, I got really bad food poisoning once when I ate a cricket. I hate them. Oh, fight it, hooky. Just hearing a cricket sure makes me feel woozy. Good job, wall. Ouchie. Uh, 
guess a toad. Oh, I guess her defense gets dropped when she hears the cricket. Oh, must not gag. My poor tummy. Blah. So very woozy. Ah, <laughs> Goombella, you're dying. Oh, that's enormous! That's actually huge! I can keep power smashing her! Keeps power smashing this dragon. I'll oh, stop her complaining, Goombella. I give up, please! I won't be so bad anymore, I promise. In fact, I'm sorry for everything. Uh, yeah! <laughs> to prove it, I'll give you a thousand coins. What do you say? Can you forgive me? Keep your coins, you stinky, disgusting piece of sh stupid dragon. What, you must be joking, you don't need any coins? Then how about the lovely, rare, extra special badge I have? I'll give you that. Oh, extra special badge. I don't know. That seems pretty damn good. It's one of a kind, and it's yours for a limited time only. Will you take it? Ah, oh, keep it, you cad. Uh, really? Well, I suppose I can apologize by letting you smell the bottoms of it. Michael Zaki, what are you doing? People pay good money to do this. I'm being completely honest right now, really. So, uh, care to take a whiff of the rich yet delicate scent of my world renown? <laughs> That's disgusting. Uh, you aren't very trusting, fellow, are you? It's important to be able to trust someone, you know? Uh, I guess I'd better... What is she doing? She need to do it? Oh my god. Oh my god, she's eating the crowd! She's in the audience! She consumed half of it! <laughs> she healed for ten! That's just terrible! Oh, <laughs> ah, my strength has returned to me! That's enough, let's finish it off once and for all. Now we're gonna get him. Why do I always have to feel so faint every time I hear a cricket? Damn, that was close. Mm, I think we just uh, wang her with the hammer. I think you're a dead dragon. <laughs> but, uh, but, uh, uh, what? There's still so much I want to do with my life. So many meals. That's 30 XB! Holy shit! That's a dead dragon. Now we can find out what they were dragging the whole time. We did it, Mario! Oh, I, get, uh, I need a breather. Oh, we have to search for the crystal. I can't seem to locate. Ooh. Ooh. What? Blah. Who the fuck is this? Yeah, I'm out! I'm finally out! I recognize that bridge of a nose anywhere. Well, it can't be. Yeah? Is his dad? He wasn't dead at all! Yeah, you're cool! Say, hey, son, you guys are so big since I last saw you. You were just a tadpole when I left. Oh yeah, I guess I have, but who cares? I mean, what happened to you? What are those? What is all this time? Well, I came here a while back to go kill this dragon, and it turns out I was what it was dragon the whole time. But just before my finishing blow, he did a trick on me, and I wanted to smell his feet. So I've been hiding in my shell for 10 years since then inside Oaktail's belly, and boy was it nasty. I'm so glad to finally get out. <laughs> Honestly, you don't know how worried I was. We all were. For ten long years, we all thought you died. 
Oh, sorry, son, but I'm okay. I was just trapped inside a giant dragon's stomach. Uh, hey, speaking of which, what are you doing here, anyway? Well, you we came and killed the dragon. <laughs> came here to defeat the thing. He was going nuts. Uh, looking for something called the Crystal Star? Crystal Star? This, you won't mean this dragon stone! Well, that's it! I found it down there in Hooktail's Valley. Nice, huh? I kept it as a souvenir. So, this is the thing you're looking for? Perfect, just perfect. You can have it. Oh? Come now, I won't take no for an answer. Your Koops' friend, please take it. Oh, yeah. Okay, sounds cool. That's the one! Yeah. That's the Crystal Star! We did it! You learned the special move, Earth Tremor! And that's Chapter 1! All finished! End of chapter! That's the whole thing! And we're gonna call it call it quits quite soon. Mario and friends finally got a crystal star in the castle after defeating Hooktail. Koops even reunited with his long lost father, whom he thought was really dead. Yet they were unable to learn anything about the whereabouts of the princess. Where could Princess Peach be? Yes, Mario's adventure has only just begun. Save all game progress up to this point? Yes. Saving do not touch memory card in slot A or the power button. Your progress was saved. And join us next time for the thrilling continuation of what the hell is going to happen next time. Oh, what do you think? What do you think's happening right now? Oh shit. A little sneak preview for next time? Doot, 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 doot. Oh my god, it's Princess Peach. Where the fuck is she? This looks like the future. This looks like space. This was like Star Trek SG, one of them. There's that one guy. Remember him? He was gonna traffic Goombella. Oh great exalted Grogoose. We brought the Princess Peach you ordered, sire. Zap zap. Electricity, electricity. Well, well, my pet, isn't it about time you told us where the map is? Oh my god, look at this weirdo. Princess Peach, you will speak when spoken to. I'm telling you, I don't know. It's a good lie. There's no point in trying to hide it, silly girl. We know you had it. We know this. Trust me, it's very much in your interest to be absolutely honest with us. We x knots are not all rainbows and lollipops, I assure you. We're quite nasty, disgusting creatures. Beep boop. Salute. Groga, sir, I have news. A report at once. You know that crystal thing we thought maybe Hooktail had? Well, somebody stole it. What? What did you say? Someone else is after the Crystal Stars? And he defeated that hooktail creature? Speak, soldier! Uh, yes sir. Sorry sir. There's more too. Uh, see, according to the report, it was a mustache dude in a red hat and blue overalls who pulled the job. Mario. Excuse me? Mario! Oh no! Oh no, this voice acted. <laughs> I see. So you know of this Mario, do you? Hmm? This fool matters not at all. I'll know all about him before long, that I promise. I grow bored of talking. Take Princess Peach back to the holding room. Yes, sir. And Ben, take good care of Princess Peach. Understand? She's not to be hurt. You got it, sir. Why'd you say the first part's so weird, then? But Lord Crump? This Mario character has the map, then it's highly likely he'll find the Crystal Star we're hunting in Bogley Woods. You must return there immediately and hasten the excavation! You must not fail. Was it? Oh yeah, sure, Roger Grotus, and with that, pow, I'm gone. I wonder if sending Lord Crump there alone is wise. He is a bit... retarded. Hmm. x not I summon you! Hey, what's good, my guy? You rang, dude? I mean, sir? You rang, Sir Grotus, dude? Grotus, sir? Shut up! Go get the Shadow Sirens over here! My elite crack team. The sh Shadow Sirens, sir, but they... I don't care how you plan to end that sentence, fool. Go get them now. Gotcha. The Honorable Grotus has need of us. Then we arrive without delay. Oh my god, he was real quick with getting him. Pray tell, did the princess tell you where the map is? Still your tongue, Beldam. We would already have it if he were snatched her earlier, but now, since you missed your chance, some poor fool named Mario has the map. It wasn't my fault, truly. There were too many prying eyes there. Too many. Besides, a strange old man showed up at the moment of the truth and we had to retreat. Why worry? All we need to do now is find this Mario and steal the map, yes? Indeed, that is your dirty duty. Must I remind you? That map is vital key to the x not plan. I will have my men prepare all available information on this Mario for now. Hear me, Beldam, you shall! Sarians must take care of this troublemaker! 
Yeah, you'll do that. Fear not, sire. I bell them shall return with what you seek. Let's go, my lovely. Hee hee hee. Marilyn, Vivian, come on. Ugh. <laughs> Oh no, my CRT. Oh dear, here we go again. I can't believe I'm kidnapped again. Mario and Toad's Earth must be worried sick again. But, hang on a moment. Where in the world am I anyway? It's so unfamiliar. I wish I could at least let Mario and Toad's Earth know that I've been caught. Oh my god, look who we're playing as. You know, f fuck it guys. We're gonna go a little bit, a little bit ahead. A little bit. We're gonna go this way now. Bing. What is this? What a lovely shower. No soap scum even. Wow, I wonder if it works. Wait, no, this is Paper Mario. You can't take a shower, you'll die. What the fuck is this fucking Princess Peach sour scene in the first 10 seconds of playing Princess Peach? I feel like that's a bit on the nose, uh, Hidetako Miyazaki. What did you mean by this? You know? What could you have meant by this? Use the paper towel? It's a paper towel. <laughs> it's like a towel paper. How refreshing. Now we go. We go right. <gasps> what is that? How's the doors? This doors. Dook, 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 dook. Dook, dook, dook. Weird, it doesn't look like anyone's around. Oh my god. How do they keep making these doors open? How odd. Hello? Are you from the hit film 2001 The Space Odyssey? Hello, Princess Peach. Huh? Why? Who said that? Where are you? How amusing. I am right here before your eyes. I am this laboratory's main computer. I am Tech XX. Many call me Tech. You may. Sir Grotus created me to be a perfect computer, one that is flawless in its reason. Grotus? Wait, he's that awful dumb head thing who's interrogated me, right? Sir Grotus is not awful. He's a very great person. He is marvelous. Well, I don't think so. But I doubt I'll change your mind. So I'm wondering, why'd you leave me in here? I am unsure. An unusual program deviation occurred when I observed you earlier. My hair, your brain circuitry malfunctioned and nearly overheated at your image. You, you fucking spying on Princess Peach while she was going nuts in the shower? Also, an unidentified impulse sped through my processors. These events are new to me. There is more to this phenomenon as well. I ran a diagnostic program and there is a solution was, I want to know more about you. I want to observe you. Such a compulsion has no precedence. As unknown, I... Per perfect computer. I must diagnose the unusual situation. I will not fail. That is why I led you here. Wait, did you just say you want to see? You want to have a chat? Could it be that you? No, impossible. It can't be. You're a silly computer. What uh, has happened to me? If you know my malfunction, you must tell me of it. Oh, I couldn't really because it's just too weird. Please tell me, please. I am the world's best computer. I am perfect. There should not be anything that I do not understand. Please. Well, you know, maybe it's possible that, well, you're... Oh my god. You think the computer... Got... It's a... It's... It's a computer... What is love? Cannot compute this. Wait, you don't know what that is? What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me no more. I think is what the computer's trying to say. Happiness, fun, is definitions, programming, something. I am very sad. Comprehend. You gotta feel. Princess Peach, will you teach me to feel this thing you call love? <laughs> <laughs> Your computer, why would you care about that? Yes. You stupid idiot. You're retarded or something. i uh, grant you an exchange. I will let you use my keyboard for emailing purposes. Uh, get me a wish? Alright. I understand. But I must learn. Um, perfect computer. That is why we considered. Are you sure? Oh, here it goes. Can I contact someone this one is better? Yes, of course you may. Use my communicator to send wireless mail to anywhere you want. If you wish, you can use it right now. It's no trouble. Use the keyboard in front of you and show the recipient's message name and message. You mean this keyboard? All right. Okay, it's ready. 
The message has been sent. For the time being, you may return to your room. I will call you again when I want to ask you something. What a weirdo. Uh, okay then, good night. Good night, Princess Peach. This is the computer. Yes. Oh my god, that was nuts. Oh my god, who could it be now? What char Game of Thrones character perspective change could this be now? Who are we playing as this time? What a silly guy. Koopa King has arrived. Hold your applause, minions. But now that I'm here, Cammy, you crusty old hag, why did you summon me? Uh, great lord, the crusty hag Kami Koopa will arrive momentarily. I'm really sorry for the inconvenience, but please wait at the rear of the room. So the other day, I saw Lord Bowser gazing longly at a photo of Princess Peach. Uh, you may want to put a cracked cork in it, man. Ooh, I'll tell you what, I was looking at his face of the mooning over that thing, huh? Oh, Lord Bowser! Oh, it's a hilarious story. I'm gonna eat you later. Hey, working hard or hardly working, eh, Jack? <laughs> But Bowser, you're so skinny! Hey, eat another sausage roll. <laughs> I've just now returned. I'm terribly sorry to keep you waiting, my lord. I bet you are, Cammy. Go now out with it. What have you called me here? Please, your grumpiness, don't be so impatient with your poor servant. Ahem. It's my displeasure to report that Mario, that scum, is off to a town called Roadport. Well, I'm not Mario's babies. I don't care what he's doing. Are you going to call me every time that guy blows his nose or what? Sheesh. Yes, well, you see, my lord, apparently Mario is hunting for an amazing treasure. Treasure? Oh, so yes, Mario's gone in search of a star-shaped jewels known as the Crystal Stars. I'm researching just what they are, but there's no question of their high value. The crystal Stars, you say? You sound like a good world-conquering tool, so I want them. Uh, yes, very good. Continue researching this for me, you brainy hag, you. Yes, sir, thank you, sir. Leave it to me. By the way, Lord Bowser, do you like fried eggs? I fucking love fried eggs. Some kind of gay fish or something? I love fried, love them, but what a weird question. Why do you ask? Well, during a Mario Mario recon, I stopped in a lovely place called Petal Meadows. I was planning on taking everyone there for a picnic, having some eggs and toast. Of course, I wouldn't think of sending out invites without asking you first, Lord Bowser. Why not? That sounds nice. A picnic? This is no time for fun. See, this is why my evil plans always derail, because you clods always goof off. Oh dear, Lord Bowser. Remember, your blood pressure! Your, your lumbago, Bowser! Think of it! What's that? Ah, yes, that's true. Lord Bowser traveled to you. Some ba a bold fool abducted Princess Peach in Rogueport. What now? What? Tell me you're lying, Kami. How, when, where, who do such a thing besides me? I'm afraid we don't have that information quite yet, sir. The investigation is ongoing. One thing is most certainly confirmed, however, the princess has been kidnapped. Under no circumstances is anyone allowed to kidnap her without my say-so. I will not stand for this. I'm going to Rogueport now. I've got to kidnap her back. Oh, he's on a little spinneroo. He's gone. But your grunginess, wait up. He's off. Yes. Coops, my lad, are you telling me that you're going with Mario? Um, that's right, that. I'm going to continue traveling with Mario. Aw, oh, and then I'm, well, uh, I'm gonna be back to strong Koopa like you, Dad. Nicely said, young Coops, that's my boy. But always remember this, you are my son, Coops. And this here's my daughter, Koopy Koo, and I am your father. 
Poops, my sweet. I'll be right here waiting for you to prove yourself as, as I'm your sister. <laughs> my dad, if anything happens, you can always come home, Coops. Oh, you ever forget that? It'll always be your home. Okay, thank you, everyone. I'm off. Bye. Sorry to keep you waiting, Mario. You know, farewells. So, where are we going? Let's head back to the rogue port. Remember, Mario. The bearer of the magical map shall unfurl it before the thousand year door. When this is done, the star shall guide the bearer to the crystal star with pure light. And then stop there. Each crystal star shall point to the next. And what's the book say? Yeah. Okay, so every time we get a crystal star, we gotta go back to the door. So that means location of the next crystal star will appear on the magic map when you get on the door. That's exactly what I mean. Get in my pocket. Alright. Boom. Oh, we got two juice now. Alright, we gotta find a save. Ball. And fuck off. Wait a. Wait a. Fucking gabagool in a minute. There's a thin bit right there. <laughs> Increase tech power by five when your partner's in peril. Absolutely, that sounds insane. I'd love putting my partners in peril. Alright, this is it. This is the last bit. Goodbye, everyone. It's been an honor and a privilege, and uh, honestly, I think there's like several funeral arrangements we gotta make now. Alright, goodbye. Forever.